morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on your time and depending on when you're going to see this video. It's your brother, your boy, Cost Reps Corner. Like I always say, it's my corner, it's your corner, and it's our corner. And I've always told us also, in my corner, we have the right to be free so that uh, we'll be free to talk to each other and try to rapport and get to hear stories from each other. That's why it's my corner. I don't want to fall in love. Just wanna have some fun, yeah. I don't wanna fall in love. I just wanna have some fun. I don't wanna fall in love. In today's video, I am not happy. I am not happy. Somebody will ask me why. It's quite unfortunate uh, what I'm about to share, and uh, I really feel pain. It, 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 these are cases I don't like sharing. But uh, what will I do? I am a content creator, and I have to give my own views about some certain issues and bring them to the limelight. Okay, so I'm not quite happy in this particular video. I'm about to share with us. It goes to show if the negligence of parents. Mm, English will not kill me. The negligence of parents. That's why when I when I always talk about parents, some persons will think that it, it, it's something else. No. If you know you're not ready to give birth to a child, please don't bring the child up or don't make a move to get a child. I don't have a child now. I am not a fool. Do you understand? I didn't want to because I did not want to put him or her in a very tight state. This is a case of... Ha, how do I say it? It's very painful. Can you see this man? Look at him. Are you seeing this man? Then look at his friends. Are you seeing these people? How many of them? Can you count? Six men. Six men. All... To one particular girl under age for that matter look at them you see why i am angry i didn't want to show face i just wanted to put your picture and do a voiceover but the case is a serious and a delicate one hmm. english will not kill me it's a very serious and a delicate one that's why i'm coming out to share it it's quite painful that our parents we used to we we, we, we relied for help and succor hmm. Cause rep, calm down. English will not kill you. Our parents will rely for help and for so and support. Are those parents that are there to tarnish our image and kill us and and delete us? A story is shared by our sister uh, Linda Ikeji's vlog. I will try. Let me shift so I can paste it there. I got it from uh, from her, her page. Just want to share my light on it. I'm going to be reading something like a. A, what would I call a story to explain what happened so that you get the logic, okay? So let me shift our pin it there so that you can see it and read. Please, I'll be looking by the side so that I can read together. So he said, Linda Ikeji official, man arrested for impregnating his daughter and also turning her into a prostitute in, her, in his house in Ogun State of Nigeria, okay? This happened in Ogun State. And Ogun State is one of the southwestern states in the Federal Republic of Nigeria. So let's continue. A 49 years old man by the name Amoda Bola was on August 17 arrested by the men of the Ogun State Police Command for allegedly impregnating his 14 years old biological daughter. You know, she's a minor, so the name is withheld, everything is withheld. You can imagine, 14 years old, and uh, the suspect, a resident of E.D. Oro Street, or Deromo, was arrested following the complaint received from the victim, who reported at Oderemo Divisional uh, Headquarters that her father was whom she was been lying, living with for some years now has been has been having kind of knowledge of her. She stated further that her father has also been inviting men 
You see this idiot man? You see this man that God will judge? This man. That God have been invited, uh, that the father have been inviting men to the house to have uh, to have fun uh, with her. Let me use that word. I can't say the other word. Let me use that word. To have fun with her after which the men will pay him money. Can you imagine? A father goes, calls his friends. This, this idiot calls them to come and continue the job. When they do, after finish, after they are finished, they pay him as a father the money for services were delivered. Is that not is that not you man humanity to man? Your own biological daughter. Let me continue reading. Upon the report, the DPO or the Remo Division CSP or Lyemi Fasobon uh, detailed his detective to the scene where the suspect was promptly arrested. On interrogation. The suspect who first denied the allegation later confessed. Later, later confessed when the victim confronted him. His confession led to the arrest of five other five others who had slept with the victim at different time on the invitation of the father. You see, at first he denied, but later, after when he saw the girl face to face. He had to he had to implicate his friends. Look at these five men. See them? Plus him himself. They are six. You see them? Look at these men who God will judge. Look at them. So the other suspects are Ahmed Ogun Koya, 30 years old, Moyiwa Adeoye, 48 years old, David Sunday Suleja, 69 years old, Emmanuel Olusonya, 50 years old. And Joshua or Lanira, 50 years old. You can imagine these five men plus him himself that is 49 years have had canon knowledge of an underage. Is what the story is painting me. Okay, let's continue. He said, confirming the incident, the spokesperson of the state police command, SP Abimbola uh, Oyeyemi, said all the suspects have been have confessed to having canon knowledge of canon knowledge of the 14 years old girl and uh, paid money to the father he mentioned that the victim who mother had separated from the father years back and have been living with the father was practically turned to a prostitute by her father one of the men or the men confessed that yes they used to come on the invitation of the father and they pay the father after they are they are done so in quote she has been taken to state hospital Isara Isara Remo, where is where it was confirmed that she is pregnant. Okay, now who is not responsible for the pregnancy? You see the problem. So that is just it. the victim has insisted that it was her father who is responsible for the pregnancy, being the only person who slept with her within the period she got pregnant. Okay. The, the girl now as 14 years old has maintained that the father was the one that she was with when she had she noticed her body was changing or had changed so she insists that the father is responsible then let's finish the story so meanwhile the commissioner of police C, uh, cp la reba conley has ordered the immediate transfer of the suspect to anti-human trafficking and child labor unit of the state criminal investigation department for discrete investigation and possible persecution, or yet, or yet, yet me said, guys, what are we not saying? Why do we have our father, our mother, if not for them to protect us? And why will you be separated from your husband and you leave your underage daughter with your husband? You see, the reason why I say our parents are uh, most of these are our parents, they need divine touch. If you know you're not ready to have a baby, don't have a baby. I'm in my 30s. I'm not saying it's best for me, but what will I do? I don't want to bring a baby that to the world that I will know I will not be there for. I'm not saying, am I a fool for not for doing that? So when you bring a baby or you bring children to the world, please be there to train them. Okay, now you are separated from your husband. Why didn't you take your daughter together with you? And you know your daughter is a girl and your husband is a man. You left a grown-up girl that you know that this is still advancing with a man. Are you not thinking? And then on normal ground, is the man supposed to even go to, to the daughter? You see, most of these men and women are married couples. Please take note. Don't be, don't be, don't be like I said, like, ah, English will not kill me. Calm down. Don't be like I said, Dick. Is it the right thing? Don't be, don't be nonchalant. Hmm. 
God's love calm down. God's love calm down. Don't be nonchalant in doing your duties as parents. Don't be nonchalant. Do things because you are the parent. I can't. Which which mark will I use in telling the story? For example, now the girl now gives pets now. What will the girl now tell the child? Who is the father of the child? She's carrying. It's very barbaric. Please let's try. Let's try. Let's try and do the needful. Let's try and do what we should do as parents. So when we saw that uh, comment, uh, people commented on that, and I brought some comment. Let me shift a while so that we can go through it. The first person said, "This is too dark." My God. Hand on the head emoji. The next person came and said, God forbid. The other one came and said, I, Is she supposed to have that child or more tears emoji? That's what I said. Is she supposed to have that child? If she has that child, who will she tell the child is her father or his father? That's the problem. Then the next one came and said, The end time or his tears emoji, fire emoji. And the other one came and said, Ikule Abiyomo or tears emoji, end time is near. The next came and said, uh, Olori Buruku Baba Oshi. That one is Yoruba, it's like an insult. Then another one came and said, What what a crazy and sad world we live. Uh, sad emoji. Then another person, somebody else came and said, Crazy things are happening. Surprise. The next came and said, Check well, the girl might not be his biological daughter in, or his blood. The same thing I said when I saw the story. The next person came and said, Oh, more. Tears emoji, God, head, hands on the head emoji. You know what I'm saying? These people, including the use you useless father, deserve life in prison. They should leave this world through the, the prison, and the pregnancy should be terminated for the sake of the health of the and the underage girl. A social, physical, spiritual, and mental health can be affected by giving birth to such a, a child. In medicine, it is allowed to terminate such pregnancy. Yes, I think I have, I've heard such cases before when the doctors will tell you, peradventure, if you give permission, this baby cannot be kept. So I support it should be removed. But as a Christian, you have committed abortion, you have removed you have removed a, a life, and it's a problem. So I don't really know what to advise here. That's what I have. Is that I, I, I me, I'm confused because I am just in, in, in between the devil and the blue sea. I don't know to, if my faith... Does not support it, but the situation supports it. So, which one do I follow as a person? Okay, so the next person came and said, Oh, more tears emoji. This is pure wickedness. The next one came and said, God, tears emoji, hands on the head. The other one came and said, uh, God, please have mercy, tears emoji. Then the other one came and said, What some men do, you use your daughter, they do waiting you fit to do yourself. Tear, so sad, sad emoji. The next one came and said, How oh, our person Bola go stand for your own daughter. Is this not cause? Yes, tears emoji. I said it before. It's somehow for your, your body to be arose or to be arisen. Hey, cause red. English will not kill you. It is uncalled for for you to have a sensation when you are with your family members. Although we have heard stories, but this particular one really touched me and made me sad. So the next one came and said, This is really sad. Tears emoji. Now, wow, every day wonders. Uh, 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 tears emoji. The other one came and said, "What? Oh Lord!" Tears emoji. The other, case, the other one came and said, "Sad, sad emoji." The other one came and said, "Jesus Christ!" Surprise. Tears emoji. The next one came and said, "Crazy things are happening." Another one came and said, "Aye mio." Tears emoji. The other one came and said, "Now nah, wow." Somebody else came and said, "Hmm, this is deep." Another one came and said, "Jeez, I'm short of words." Emoji. The other one came and said, "This is this is a dead soul." That is shattering Lucifer. How how on earth? My hands on the head emoji, tears emoji. Then we have another one that came and said, uh, this, Imagine this madness, tears emoji. God, I beg go. The other one came and said, War don't end. Next came and said, Evil happening. The other one came and said, Crazy things are really happening. Somebody else came and said, Hmm, surprise emoji, tears emoji. Then the last but not the least I'll take here, he said, If the baby is born, Father becomes grandpa. Father's daughter will now be mother and step sister to the baby. You see, so it does what this, this, uh, they all said. So I don't really know what the plan of the government is, uh, but I feel the baby is um, the girl in question is still in a in a in a in a uh, tent or in a tent, and uh, they should consider and know what best way to suit 
I don't just know what you would call that. Me, I can't. I'm short of words. I am kept between my belief and what I believe should happen. But for me, uh, neglecting or just saying, going in general, what I see, the baby should be terminated now. Or better still, if they can keep the baby, once she gives her to the baby, the baby is taken away from her and, and maybe kept in social care or give to somebody that is looking for baby. Because such a baby might, might bring up a, a social... Uh, how do I bring? How do I say it? So maybe they, they will use people will be using that face to look at the poor girl. So that's just it. So guys, I'm really dumbfounded. Hmm, English will not kill me. I'm really dumbfounded. I'm really flagabasted. Hmm, calm down. I'm really flagabasted. I am I'm short of words. I don't know what to. I'm emotional. When I saw it, I, it has been about two days. I saw it. I think about two days, if I'm not mistaken. I just kept it. To bring it out was just ah, cost rep. Can you do this story? Can you say it out? Please say it out. That kind of a thing. And so, since when I got it, I've been ah, this is really touching. But what are we going to do? We don't have a choice but to share the news so that our parents out there will know that yes, we are human beings like them and we know what we want and what we are doing, guys. Having said that, guys, I've come to the end of this video. I want to thank all of us for watching the useless things I bring. Thank you so much for the love and the care. I'm really grateful. Please share this video so that it can help somebody who is still trapped. We have, we still have many people who are trapped as I talk to you now. Share this video for them to learn. Okay? Guys, see, I come away next time to see me your screen. I leave all of us in peace.